In today's Marvel Cinematic Universe MCU update, we're diving into a blend of exciting and less encouraging news regarding the character of Kang the Conqueror. Fans of the MCU can breathe a sigh of relief knowing Marvel Studios is committed to keeping Kang as a central antagonist in the unfolding multiverse saga and the upcoming Avengers Secret Wars. However, the prospects for Jonathan Majors reprising his role as the time-traveling villain are dimming. Previously, there was speculation that if Majors successfully appealed his legal issues, Disney might welcome him back to embody Kang once again. This theory, however, appears increasingly unlikely. Major's career faces significant challenges, overshadowing his potential return to the MCU. Despite this setback, Kang's narrative arc within the MCU remains compelling. Introduced with a mix of menace and mystique, Kang's character arc offers a glimpse into his expansive conquests across universes, setting up thrilling future encounters. Amidst the uncertainty surrounding Major's involvement, Marvel Studios has been contemplating the character's future. A pivotal decision loomed. Whether to retire Kang in favor of a new adversary or to recast Majors. Insights from industry insiders, including Daniel Richman known as Danilok, suggest that while Kang will continue to be a key villain, Marvel is also exploring the introduction of another formidable foe. The spotlight now turns to Doctor Doom, a character rumored to make an appearance in the Fantastic Four reboot. Discussions within Marvel Studios, as reported by various outlets, have entertained the idea of transitioning the villainous mantle from Kang to Doctor Doom. This move would not only address the immediate concerns related to Major's legal troubles, but could also align the MCU more closely with its comic book roots especially in the context of Secret Wars. Doctor Doom's potential role in the saga could introduce a dynamic new layer to the narrative, setting the stage for an epic showdown that reflects the complexity and depth of the source material. As for Jonathan Majors, the actor's path forward appears fraught with challenges. A new lawsuit for defamation, assault, and battery has emerged, further complicating any potential for a comeback as Kang. This development casts a long shadow over Major's career and his association with Marvel Studios. In the interim, speculation abounds regarding Coleman Domingo as a potential successor to Major's for the role of Kang. Domingo's acknowledgement of discussions with Marvel hints at the possibility of a new actor taking up the mantle of the time-traveling conqueror, ensuring that Kang's influence in the MCU continues unabated. This evolving situation reflects the delicate balance Marvel Studios must maintain between storytelling integrity and the realities of off-screen controversies. As the MCU ventures further into the multiverse saga, the emergence of new villains alongside Kang promises to enrich the narrative tapestry, offering fans a mix of familiarity and innovation in the face of unforeseen challenges. Till I get up, time is barely on our side.